Welcome to Pine Ridge, a 280 unit subdivision of quadruplexes and duplexes, of which this offering is for 84 units. Now you're gonna wanna stick around to the end of the video where I give a full summary of the deal, but let me tell you why you're gonna wanna call me as soon as this video is over. The subject offering is made up of all two bedroom, one baths measuring almost 900 square feet but the average in place rent is only 545 a month. Now, there are five rental complexes in the immediate submarket whose starting rents for two ones is 700 a month. And the average in place among those five is 753 a month. Let's go. Now we're gonna go take a drive of the exterior of the units. And first we're gonna start off on 57th place. This is the first building. Look how gorgeous the landscaping is. And that was done by the tenants themselves. All right, here we go. Now what we have here is quadruplexes on the left hand side and he owns almost all of these brick colored buildings. And then on the right side are duplexes starting right here with the brick ones. So it's duplex, 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 and quadruplex all the way down for the next four buildings. Each of them line the streets and he owns both sides. Now we're rounding on the 25th terrace. All right, so here we've got duplexes all along the side of the subdivision here. And then we got quadruplexes on the left side and he owns both sides all the way down the street. Now, as we continue to drive, we've got quadruplexes on the left side of the street, starting right here with these brick ones, all the way down to the end of the run. And now we're coming up on another side street and we've got another duplex and quadruplexes on the side right here. Continuing down, he continues to own all the quadruplexes right here on, along the left side. And then he owns the single duplex right here on the right hand side. Ooh, we got us a playground. Now, we're gonna go take a look at the interiors. Woo! All right, we get to walk inside the units. I love the concrete block construction with brick veneer. Now, these are all two bedroom, one bath, as I, as I explained. All the floor plans are roughly the same, except they differ a little bit from duplexes to quadruplexes. Now, let's go inside. Ha ha ha, I love it. All right, as we walk in, we've got a living, dining, kitchen combo throughout. Wood laminate floors through the vast majority of the units. As we walk into the kitchen area, most of the countertops and cabinetry are roughly the same. The only differences are some of the, ca some of the cabinets are painted in different colors. We got white appliances throughout. Here is where the furnace and water heater is. Got a cool little pantry right here. And then as we peel around into the hallway, got a nice little linen closet or coat closet, whatever you want to call it. Right in the hallway here, all units have washer and dryer hookups. And as we peel into the one bathroom, all of the cabinets and countertops are roughly the same throughout the bathrooms as well plastic or metal tubs. And then we're gonna come into the guest bedroom. In the guest bedroom, I think 70% of the units have carpet throughout. And then we've got, here's the guest closet. So it starts right here, ends about right here. Pretty good size. Let me show you the master though. 
Now in the hallway, we've got a cool linen closet right at the end of the hallway. And then as we peel into the master bedroom, good size, bigger, but we got the walk-in closets, which go all the way to about right here. Come check this thing out, man. What? Huge pain shoes, all you need. All right, now I'm gonna orient you back to the front of the unit. All right, we got the bathroom on the left, washer and dryer on the right, kitchen up on the left, living dining combo. Now we're gonna go up high and I'm gonna show you all the retailers in the area, the subdivisions, and then you're gonna meet me back at Dunkin' Donuts, which is right around the corner. See you soon. Woo! Put this in. All right, and now it's time for the summary. Here's the deal. 84 units, which is composed of 10 duplexes and 16 quadruplexes. They're all two bedroom, one baths, averaging almost 900 square feet. I told you the rents are averaging 545 a month, but there are five rent comps in the area starting at $700 a month. Now, 80% of the leases are month to month which makes it really easy for you to go in there and add value. And the average length of stay of these tenants is four and a half years. And they've got a number of tenants that have been there 10 years and two tenants that have been there over 20 years. We have all of the leases digitized. So once we're in contract, we can send them right to you. All the buildings are averaging about 1984 construction with a number of them around 1990. And here's the really cool thing about buying multiple parcels. You got 26 parcels. That becomes, when you purchase them all on one deed, it becomes a disqualified transaction with the Department of Revenue, which is who the county municipalities report to. So what that means is there is no 80 or 85% of the purchase price as it pertains to property taxes. The property taxes hardly jump at all because they don't know what value to apply to which individual parcel. It's awesome, it's gonna save you a ton of money on that. This owner has been buying these units over the last 20 years, self-managing it, self-leasing it. Lots of actual handwritten records that we've now digitized to Excel for you. Plenty of management efficiencies that you can improve on. I'm telling you guys, this is the one. Bring me an offer. Let's go. Woo!